Hello guys, welcome to BMS Crypto YouTube channel. Um, here we talk about cryptocurrency, we talk about airdrop, we talk DeFi, NFTs, testnets, and how to actually make money from crypto, right? So um, just subscribe on notifications so you get notified whenever we drop a new video in the YouTube channel, right? So today we're going to be talking about the ZK swap uh, testnet on the ZK Sync uh, era blockchain, which is a layer 2, right? In our past videos, we've like analyze zk sync i've also done a um, video on sync swap and today we're going to be talking about zk swap and automated market uh on zk sync right so first of all uh we're going to be needing Fossat testnet Fossat testnet tokens and we're going to be needing our metamax wallet as usual so first of all we're going to use chain list to add um to add let's go to chain list so we're going to add the zk sync testnet blockchain into our wallet right so i'm going to like zk sync then um i'm going to include testnet here so when i include testnet here now the test the zk sync testnet chain will appear then i'll add it to my metamax right i'm gonna click and here we have zk sync error testnet so i'm gonna add it to my metamax so here we'll go down and i approve it now it's added i can switch to it now so currently i am on zk sync era testnet right so i'm going to connect to the app.zkswap.xyz so i'm going to connect to it connect then i'm going to i'm going to request for foresight right um we'll go to zk sync right we already connected our wallet we'll go to the faucet so they will ask for a retweet for us to claim the testnet so we'll go to twitter you can see here we'll come here we'll add and we'll retweet that tweet now we'll go back Um, we click this. Okay. So, which is the same normal way, right? Click on register on Akami and get the facade, then you bridge right so we're going to use this bridge right if you <coughs> if you understood what happened here right let's say we need Corilla 8 i'm going to add a link to of this to the video description but it's just uh going to the Corilla 8 chain right where we are going to connect our wallet and We'll, we'll log into Alchemy. In my past videos on other testnets, I've already shown how to like create account on an, on Alchemy, so you could be able to like accept assess this for right? So let's copy the link. I'm going to copy the link here. I'm going to confirm I'm not a bot. You're going to sign in here as well, right? With your email just use your email to sign in it's as simple as that just use this use your email and sign in and you'll be asked to verify that you're a human for you to continue so you just verify the capture
okay you have to be smart on it so you don't miss out okay you verify it you choose that you're not a developer and which change you prefer you can you can use a uh, zk sync in the guide they said we should select um ethereum and free version and skip and zk swap so here we are ethereum free skip and zk swap then we'll click on let's build so uh you've registered for akemi right you'll be logged in then you paste your wallet then you click on your bot verify and you send okay i need some eat as well on the main net right so i'm gonna go send some eat to the main net So I have actually sent some it to it, right? Now I'm going to click on verify once again. Then I don't know if the it has arrived though, but it has been sent. So I'm gonna click this again. Now it has gone through, right? When it when it go through, you will see a different color spray on the screen. That is how you will know it has gone through, right? So the next thing now to do is go back to the swap decks you go back let's go back to the medium now we'll bridge right we're going to bridge we're going to actually bridge we use this bridge now click on it so we're going to bridge the token we have the test token we have from ethereum mainnet we will bridge it to zk sync mainnet right the uh, ethereum we have on Z on ethereum testnet gorilla testnet to zk sync testnet network so uh, i'm going to put 0 0.01 and we're going to have i'm going to deposit 0 0.01 Oh wow. So now we're having issue with the, the gas. So what, what what I'm going to do is I have I already have a wallet that I have plenty gorilla test net. So I'm going to send plenty gorilla test net from that wallet to this wallet. Right, so I could be able to do the tr transaction now. If you have uh, issue with the testnet tokens, you could just hit me up. I'll be able to send you some, or you could just buy. I think there's a bridge where you could actually buy these test tokens, right? Just buy. So I'm going to send one here for this tax. So I've sent one gorilla eat to the wallet. Transaction has been submitted and it has gone through but it has not arrived here yet so let's see if i'm going to on show testnet networks i'm gonna on it um i'm going to see gola test net token chain so i'm going to close this now i have one i have imported one so I'm going to reload this page so that it will show here so i could actually easily bridge the test token i want to bridge right so i'm going to bridge zero point one 
now I have enough to pay gas so it's going to go through, definitely I'm going to confirm and that will be it now I've bridged it to ZK sync error testnet 0.1 it I can bridge as any amount as I want so now I'm going to go to the swap decks right and change the network to ZK sync error I'm going to metamax and change it to ZK sync error error test nets right remember I've breached but it has not actually arrived so since transition have been submitted um, let's check the balances we have it has not arrived still so let's hope it arrives soon So while we are waiting for it, it has still not arrived. So le let's explore, explore this, right? So first we can swap our it to ZK USDT, right? Now we can also in in using the pool. So here in the pool, you uh, you search for the pairs you want to like uh, stake on, provide liquidity for. Then you just select them and put the uh, uh, the equal amount of money you want to like provide liquidity with so here yeah, i'm going to be providing liquidity with zk die and it so what i'm going to do on this swap is i'm going to swap it to zk die it's a stable coin right and this has not arrived yet 0 0.0 0.3 so I'm trying to bridge more font to it. The one I bridged has not even arrived yet, so it's gonna take up to five minutes from what they say here. All right? So the transaction has been submitted, right? And we can see from the transaction S can it's it's, it's still the transaction included and will be reflected in a short while. <laughs> it's success already, right? So, and we already had the first one we did, but it's still not arrived yet. So, we're going to switch back to the guessing error test. Okay, perfect now the first one we did has already arrived so now we can just breed we can just swap 0, 0.0 b right yes now I'll swap it to this on zk swap confirm transaction has been submitted now we'll go to the pool we're going to provide liquidity now with it i'm going to click the add plus sign add liquidity now i'm going to the swap has been successful active i'm going to choose active and click next and i'm going to select oh this is wrapped it this is wrapped it that is wrapped it so let's see this one all of them are wrapped it so we're going to go back to the swap decks and swap uh, some of the it we have to 0 0.03 to 
to eat we're going to wrap some of the eats we have to wrap to it like then we can use it to provide liquidity so we'll confirm and we'll go back to the any and we'll go to the zk die the eat the eat slash zk die liquidity pool so we'll add active lower yield so we we'll choose active as well, as always so here we'll come and we'll say 0 0.02 you see it gives us the equivalent here we we'll approve the eat approve the zk die and preview then provide the supply the liquidity then we can test the bridge as well so could just put marks you approve then we'll approve the zk die as well we max it <coughs> then we next it and we'll approve it then i have submitted for the two the two has been approved you can see here then we'll preview and we'll supply just normal how to provide liquidity on any decks any decentralized exchange any liquidity pool any youth farming get all this is just it i'm going to approve the supply transaction has been submitted now you need to fund this with enough it so that you'll be able to pay gas fees right so i have a position here so i'm going to go to the pools it's going to take time to appear obviously so i'm going to go to the bridge now the bridge is taking us back to the gorilla bridge so we're, which we already done so we've tested out the swap decks we've tested, tested out the pools now i'm going to click on my pools but because the transaction is still pending it might not still show us my pools to say no liquidity pool found but once it's created it's still pending once it's successful okay you see it's liquidity pool has been added successfully now you look this is my pool size and that so that's that about that guys um this is just testnet on zk swap right thank you so much guys for watching subscribe share the video comment if you're confused and i will clear you and all notifications so you get the videos when they drop